moving uh, moving on to uh, uh, monthly complaint report. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. You guys have your monthly complaint report there. I do want to point out that you do have a revised version of the October complaint. Now, your police chief is going to come in here tonight and report a bunch of complaints, but he can't even seem to get the complaint right because I've got copies of the form dated October 24th. And not, that complaint doesn't match up on anything that he has on that list. Comes close on a couple, but not the same charges, not the same exoneration. What's up? Uh, you have a revised version of the October complaint report. Um, after our meeting that month, um, it was uh, brought up that not everything was included. And so we've gone back and uh, added some additional details um, that include, uh, we reported that the complaint involved excessive uh, use of force, false report, tampering with evidence. Um, there was also a standards of conduct and an improper conduct uh, complaint that was not included in the report. So it's in the revised report now, and I wanted to point that out to you. Um, and then uh, if you have any questions, I'd be happy to answer those. Public comment, Mr. Ravi. Yeah, I'd like to know why we just accept that. Here's the complaint report. If you have any questions, ask. Why can't he read them out? Why can't he read out for the public what those complaints were and the exonerations? Because all of them are exonerated again. And that report that they had to update is this. Because I called your chief a liar. <laughs> 